Hi there, welcome to the latest look at constellations and today we're going to look at Hydra, the water snake, the largest constellation in the sky, but it lies in the southern hemisphere. Its head is located south of Cancer and its tail lies between Centaurus and Libra. It represents the Linnaean Hydra from the Greek myth of Hercules' twelve labours. It has a number of notable sky objects in it, deep sky objects in it, including M48, but we'll look at those a little bit later. Major stars-wise, Alphard, or Alpha Hydri, is an apparent, has an apparent magnitude of 2.0. It's about 177 light-years from us. It's the brightest star in the constellation. And Gamma Hydri is the second brightest, with an apparent magnitude of 2.9, and is 133 light-years from us. Zeta Hydra is the third brightest, with an apparent magnitude of 3.1 and is approximately 167 light years from us. And Beta Hydra is a binary star, 370 light years distant from us, with an apparent magnitude of 4.2. Our Hydra is a Myra type variable, a red giant with an apparent magnitude that changes from 3.5 to 10 over a period of 389 days. It's approximately 410 light years from us. V Hydra is a carbon star. It's one of the reddest stars in the nighttime sky with a BV colour index of plus 5.5. And it's classified as a semi regular variable. Its apparent magnitude changes from 7 to 11 over a period of about 18 years. It's about 1,300 light years from us. And U Hydra is another carbon star, one of the few carbon stars that can be seen without binoculars, as it's a giant with an apparent magnitude of 4.93. It's about 677 light years from us. Before we go on, may I just say please subscribe to this channel. Subscribers are really important because they show that people appreciate what I'm doing. So thank you. Deep sky objects, we have Messier 48, M48, an open star cluster, believed to be about 300 million years old, with an apparent magnitude of 5.5, about 1500 light years from us. And Messier 68, a globular cluster, discovered by Messier in 1780, with an apparent magnitude of 9.6, about 33,000 light years from us. And the Southern Pinwheel Galaxy, Messier 83. Um, it's a barred spiral, and it has a visual magnitude of 7.54, and is approximately 40 million light years from us. An interesting one here, NGC 3242, or Caldwell 59, the ghost of Jupiter. Discovered uh, by William Herschel, the British astronomer, on February the 7th, 1785. It's a planetary nebula with an apparent magnitude of 8.6 and is about 1,400 light years from us. And NGC 3314, interesting picture this one. It's a pair of overlapping spirals. They're 117 and 140 million light years distant from us. And they have a visual magnitude of 12.5 but there are no physical connections between them. It just happens that one lies directly between us and the other. Well, I hope you enjoyed that look at um, Hydra. Take care. Dark skies. Speak to you next time. Bye for now. and Thank you.